Hello everyone, and welcome to our channel. Today's topic is, why these countries are illegal immigrants to the US. Stay tuned if you are curious about these places. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel before we move on to the video. If you're ready, let's get started. Number one, Mexico. In the realm of economic adversity in Mexico, where pervasive destitution and limited employment prospects prevail, a multitude is impelled to explore superior prospects in the United States. The lure of increased compensation and a higher standard of living acts as a catalyst for clandestine migration, which is fervently pursued in search of improved fiscal prospects. In certain Mexican regions struggling with elevated unemployment rates, individuals seek occupational refuge abroad, with the United States emerging as a neighboring and enticing alternative. The yearning for unwavering vocation and financial stability emerges as a central force driving clandestine migratory endeavors. The Mexican landscape struggles with social and political turbulence, grappling with dilemmas such as venality, criminality, and turmoil. The arduous security milieu in certain regions drives residents to seek refuge and a more balanced ambiance, primarily in the United States. The geographic proximity of Mexico and the United States facilitates the clandestine movement of migrants, despite efforts to regulate illegal crossings. The shared border accelerates the flow of individuals and defies attempts to curtail clandestine crossings. Number two, El Salvador. As El Salvador grapples with elevated levels of gang-related violence, it is caught in a web of dangerous circumstances. The pervasive nature of this violence has created an environment fraught with danger, forcing many Salvadorans to seek refuge and better prospects within the borders of the United States. The confluence of limited economic opportunities, skyrocketing unemployment rates, and meager wages within El Salvador create formidable barriers for individuals seeking to support themselves and their loved ones. The lure of migrating to the United States emerges as a potential gateway to better professional prospects and improved financial equilibrium. El Salvador, mired in intermittent bouts of political turbulence and corruption, struggles with the resulting erosion of confidence in its institutional framework. The resulting atmosphere of uncertainty and distrust often drives individuals to seek opportunities beyond the country's borders. Vulnerable to natural disasters such as seismic disturbances and hurricanes, the nation struggles with the aftermath. Widespread devastation, population dislocation, and loss of livelihoods. Such disasters act as catalysts, forcing people to migrate in search of more secure livelihoods. Number three, Guatemala. In Guatemala, widespread poverty and a lack of economic prospects persist, especially in rural areas. Many Guatemalans seek more lucrative employment opportunities and higher wages in the United States to improve their quality of life and provide for their families. The nation grapples with a historical backdrop of political instability and malfeasance, fostering a pervasive skepticism of government institutions. This volatility has led the population to seek a more stable and secure existence within the borders of the United States. Guatemala struggles with high levels of crime and violence, including activities associated with gangs and the illegal drug trade. The pervasive atmosphere of insecurity poses a palpable threat to individuals and families, forcing them to seek refuge in search of safety and a more serene environment. In addition, Guatemala is vulnerable to natural disasters such as hurricanes, seismic events, and volcanic eruptions. These events have the potential to devastate communities and disrupt livelihoods, ultimately forcing migration in search of refuge in a more stable environment. Number four, India. In pursuit of better economic prospects, many individuals from India may look to the United States. This inclination is driven by the lure of more lucrative employment opportunities, prospects for career advancement, and an overarching desire for a higher standard of living. Within the borders of the United States, a plethora of prestigious educational institutions beckon, and it is not uncommon for Indian scholars to pursue higher education at these institutions. Upon completion of their academic endeavors, a contingent may choose to extend their stay in search of gainful employment or other opportunities for personal and professional growth. The lure is not only financial, but also intertwined with the perceived improvement in the quality of life, superior health care, 
and general refinement of the standard of living in the United States. Together, these factors act as a magnet, drawing individuals from the Indian subcontinent to American shores. In certain cases, the impetus for emigration can be traced to concerns about political stability or security dilemmas in their home countries. In such circumstances, the lure of a more stable and secure existence drives individuals to embark on the journey of relocation, seeking solace in the promise of a better life awaiting them in the United States. Number 5. Honduras In Honduras, the challenge of dealing with high levels of violence and crime, particularly related to drug trafficking and gang activity, is significant. The prevailing insecurity drives many individuals and families to seek refuge in the United States, which is often perceived as a haven. Honduras faces widespread impoverishment and economic fragility, limited employment opportunities, low wages, and a lack of economic prospects fuel a yearning for a better life in the United States. Aspirations revolve around access to better job prospects and a higher standard of living. The nation has endured periods of political instability, including coups and contested elections. The resulting unpredictability and sometimes oppressive political milieu act as an impetus for individuals to seek political asylum or refuge in the United States. Corruption is a major problem in Honduras, casting a shadow over many facets of daily life. Weak institutions, including the police and judiciary, contribute to a perception of lawlessness. Some may perceive the United States as a bastion where the rule of law is more consistently manifested. In this video, we have listed the countries that migrate illegally to the U.S. country and explain the reasons. When we look at the reasons for illegal immigration in general, factors such as economic reasons, political instability, unemployment, high quality of life in the U.S. country. If you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video.